Spreading the Words is a series on the histories of Irish words from literature and everyday life. Written by Sharon Boothnot and Maura Nivwainig and produced in association with the book A History of Ireland in 100 Words and the Electronic Dictionary of the Irish Language. In this piece, a reader is Regina E. Chulatain. Clabber. Clabber is a word that is thoroughly embedded in the Hiberno-English of South Derry, and Heaney delivers it with childlike relish in Death of a Naturalist. Recalling how, in the sucking clabber, I would splash delightedly. This word seems to have entered the English language only in the 19th century. One of the earliest attestations from Ireland is in a version of Yeats' play, The Countess Kathleen. Later, Yeats' reference to the dead leaves and clobber of four forests was echoed and outdone in Joyce's Ulysses, which alludes to the clobber of ten forests. Irish clabber, meaning mud, underlies both northern clabber and its more southerly alternative clobber. The Irish word itself is not an old one, though. There seems to be no instance prior to 1649. A book of songs collected from Ulster was published in that year, and this contains various forms of clabber, including a phrase that will be familiar to many people in the English translation. Saglabber gijiagloon means in clabber to the knees.